Sheldon Phillips, and I'm playing uh, Mr. Adams, that is uh, Frankie's father. My name is Paul Bowie, and I play Honey Brown. I'm Sophia, and I play Doris and Barney. Uh, my name is Nate Dunaway, and I play Jarvis, who is the groom who is getting married, and Frankie's older brother. I am Reagan Goins, and I play Janice. My name is Claire Ricks, and I play Helen Fletcher. My name is Jeremy Rashad Brown, and I'm playing the part of D.T. Williams. I'm Jago Kiora Mystic. Uh, I am John Henry West. My name is Chelsea Manasseri. I am playing the role of Bernie Sadie Brown. I'm Taylor Flanagan, and I play Frankie. I like the way that it's described in the book. Uh, He'll only talk to you with a series of grunts before his first coffee. Nice. Very relatable. Right. <laughs> Very relatable. Honey is uh, Bernice's brother. Um, he's a young man, very much dissatisfied with the racism that he experienced. I'd also describe him as a renaissance man who wants to change the status quo. Um, Doris is, I would say, like, someone who's kind of peeking at 13, 14, 15, she's kind of at, she's at that spot. She's like having parties with boys. She's having a great time, mm -hmm. which is a little bit sad because I think that this is going to be the period that she looks back on and says, man, those were the days. But I mean, it sucks if it's like your teenage years that you're saying that about. Mm -hmm. And Barney is just some dumbass young boy. He's a soldier. He's kind of a young, good old boy. Uh... Yeah, kind of in the prime of his life, not too much to worry about. He reminds me a lot of my grandpa, who recently passed, who was a, a southern boy who, you know, went to the army and came back and had his own lovely bride. So uh, it kind of brings me back to that. It's kind of a way to honor him and nice. kind of that history. So That's rest awesome. in peace, Papa Jim. Aww. Janice is um, the fiance, Frankie's brother's fiance. Um, she's a good old southern girl who loves her man. <laughs> Uh, queen bitch. She's awful. TT is a gentleman, first and foremost, however. He um, is a product of the environment and the times. Mm -hmm. When it comes specifically to black America and black men in America at that time in the 1940s, 50s. So um, he plays respectability politics mm. a lot. And uh, that's his way of surviving. Well, he's kind of this little kid. He's hyperactive a bit. She would probably get a diagnosis for ADHD. Bernice is awesome. I think that she's really cool. I think that she's knowledgeable. I think she's got that sort of cool intelligence that a lot of older, experienced women have. And uh, I just think that she's really awesome. She's in a time of her life where she's experiencing everything very intensely, uh, the highs and the lows. Um, she's very insecure about where she fits in with the world, and she's looking for where that might be, where does she fit, and who could she be. So, she's a lot. Really, it's a learning process. I mean, you know, I'm from up north, and playing a southern guy in Georgia has been kind of a challenge, but <laughs> I'm working on it day by day. I'm thrilled to be here, and this is really cool, and everyone's been really awesome. It's been wonderful. Uh, community theater's been a lot of fun. This is my first time doing it, so um, I hope to do it more in the future. This process has been really great um, and super intimidating, and I've uh, been loving and fearing most moments of this, this whole rehearsal process, but I couldn't ask for nicer, sweeter people to be around me while I have uh, my internal crises. <laughs> uh, so far it's actually been a whole heck of a lot of fun. The process has been so easy, so easy and so um, freeing to the point to where you have the actual liberty to express yourself artistically from what the script has, you know, available. Um, I've met some amazing people. Hey. And I've gotten to work with them, and I'm just so honored to be able to share the stage and share our talents with one another. Oh, I look forward to working with all of y'all, and so far this process has been so much fun, and I enjoy it tremendously. feel honored doing it. 
it's wonderful. I'm so happy to be involved. The show is amazing. I fell in love with it when I first read it. I'm so excited to be working with Ms. Taylor, who I'm pointing to behind the camera. It's been a wonderful experience. It's a wonderful play, and I'm super thrilled to be involved. Yay. Come see our show. Thank you, and thank you, Glasses.